Hello, this is Liam DC Gaming. Um, uh, today I'm going to show you how to use fillers. Um, they're a great tool. These are some buildings that I made earlier with the filler. It takes you about a minute less to build these with the filler. The filler is an amazing tool. So I'll go straight into it. Um, just get if you're in survival, I'm not going to show you how to do it because it'll take some time. So just get a filler, get some redstone cells. If you aren't survival though, just use the recipe mode and don't use redstone energy cell, just use redstone engines. They're a, bit, they're a lot slower, I should, in fact I'll show you right, they're like 10 times slower. They're a lot slower but if you're in survival it helps. You also need landmarks and a lot of materials, well it depends what, what you're building and um, how big it is, right, so. The landmarks show where the building is like so. Yeah, to get that line up, you just right click. You like you, you place one, place another one, right click on it. Yeah, like so. I'll show you again. So place it, right click on it, and just do that until you get the radius that you want. And I'll just use bricks. Yeah, but on the on the ones that you see I've made earlier, there's like different types of wool make like a rainbow effect. On the one on the end, I like that one. It's a plain idea, but still good. If you want to do that, I'll show you how to do that one. It's not really different from the main. It's not really different from the main design. So you build like, um, like a little, I don't know, like a little column sort of thing of how high you want it. You know what I'm saying? So just build it up until you're happy with the height that it's at, and that's that'll be your height you're building. And just place a landmark on it, and right click on it. it should create this box. If it doesn't. And it just creates one like sort of line. Just right click on the ones at the bottom, all of the ones at the bottom, and it should do it. Yeah, it's it's a bit buggy, but um, that's good. So when you're done with that and you got the dimensions that you want, place the filler down. It should get this like like um police tape or something like that. Then, oop. then just right click on this. This is the weird part. Um, there's patterns. So like if you want. Just a building without it being filled in, you just do a box and it'll give you that shape. But if you want the building filled in, so it's just like one thick column, it'll go check you just do that. And if you want, say, like a staircase sort of thing, you, you would do that. <coughs> It'd give you sort of pyramid sort of shape. And also, if you want to take something away, it's sort of like the same as a quarry, but um, it's. It's uh, you don't get them to. In fact, yeah, no, no, you do. You don't. I don't know, right? So you do that, and you get that on, and that will take away everything within the radius, apart from the ground, like within within the radius of what you put. So if you just want to make a building, just follow my um, tutorial. Just do that. It should come up with that. Um, I'll start with the redstone engine. Oh yeah, you can't use redstone engines, can you? Oh no, you can't. Yeah. I'm seeing if you use them um, sterling engines or magmatic engines. Right. Right now it should it should pump them into there. Now you just you just place the materials that you want in there and it's quite slow. It's really quite slow. Yeah, can you see it? Yeah, but we don't want that. So you take away the redstone engine, place this, and look how fast it goes. Watch. Let's run out of materials here. Oop, not slabs. So I'll stick the slabs in. Actually, Wait, look how much it eats. That much is that material look compared to what the engines do. Um. This way is a lot faster, my way is 10 times faster. In fact, I think it's finished. Oh no, it hasn't. Oop, it's finished. When you're done, just take away you know, the platform that you used for the landmark, just take away this. Oop. Has it done yet? Yeah, done. See, 
See, that that was less than a minute. That was about mm, 40, 45 seconds. See? Perfect. And then that, that's who's that, this is how you get your building. And then you just do the interior. Yeah. So, in fact, I will show you also how to build, like, the the pyramid soil base. In fact, I'll make the square even. It's full. So you just do the same with the landmarks as you were doing before. Just join them up together. And do the height no I don't know about the height actually. In fact no you don't do the height. See so you just put the filler in and you get bricks. Yeah, by the way you have to use bricks as your like as your base material, like when you're using the blueprints, if you know what I'm saying. Like with this th this thing here, you have to use bricks, otherwise it doesn't work. So you and you do exactly the same and it should oh Oh yeah, I see what I did wrong. Alright, oh, doesn't matter. Now I'll get to show you how you take away things. Alright, you put bricks on the bottom. It doesn't matter if you put two in really, it doesn't matter. Then you just give it an energy so oh yeah. You need a use the landmarks again as soon as you connect the landmarks oh yeah as soon as you connect connect the landmarks it sh yeah like that did you see it in the corner there and it should take away yeah I want it Well, I'll do another episode on that just in case you want to know. So, yeah, if you want to know how to do that one, I'll show you. Just if you if you want to know, just put it in the comments or something like that. So this is um the end of my third tech it video. So I'll see you later.